Hey everyone, it's exciting news from the tech world. Samsung's already testing out One UI 7, their version of Android 15. And guess what? It's not on the Galaxy S24 Plus this time. It's actually on a Galaxy S23 Ultra that's leading the charge by running Android 15 ahead of most of us still on Android 14. Renowned leaker Tauron Vats uncovered this gem, also shedding light on the earlier discovery of the Galaxy S24 Plus with Android 15. According to Geekbench 6, the Galaxy S24 Plus scored 21 14 points in single core and 66 16 points in multi core tests. Now, the Galaxy S23 Ultra rocking One UI 7 is specifically the US carrier lock version. Following Google's announcement of Android 15 stability, Samsung's actively testing it on their current lineup. They're gearing up to roll it out for public beta testing through the One UI 7.0 beta program in the coming months. Initially, Samsung plans to kick off the One UI 7.0 beta program with the Galaxy S24 series and the Galaxy Z Fold 6. After a couple of months of testing, they'll extend it to Galaxy S23 users. Samsung aims to release the stable version of One UI 7.0 for compatible high-end phones in the Galaxy S and Galaxy Z series. Once the Galaxy S23 Ultra receives the One UI 7.0 update, it will still have two more major Android OS updates left. Samsung's committed to delivering four major Android OS updates and five years of security updates for the Galaxy S23 series, as well as the Galaxy Z Flip 5 and Galaxy Z Fold 5. Samsung typically releases a new One UI version annually between October and December. While the exact release date isn't confirmed yet, the Samsung Developer Conference 2024, scheduled for October 3rd, might unveil all the new features of One UI 7.0. Last year, they did something similar with One UI 6.0, revealing it shortly after the conference in October. One UI 7.0 is based on Android 15, and Samsung's already begun internal testing. They're planning to update over 50 Galaxy phones and tablets with this new interface. Recently, Google dropped Android 15 Beta 3, marking its stability. This paves the way for One UI 7, based on Android 15, to soon become available for all compatible Galaxy smartphones and tablets. What are your thoughts on this exciting update? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more tech news. See you in the next video. Peace out asterisk asterisk. their development of major software updates of One UI 7.0. Based on the company's track record, we can expect the One UI 7.0 beta program to start in the third quarter of this year, with the stable release of One UI 7.0 happening in the fourth quarter. If you have an eligible high-end Galaxy S, Galaxy Tab, or Galaxy Z series device, you will be among the first to get the One UI 7.0 update. After that, the update will be released to mid-range Galaxy phones and tablets, followed by entry-level smartphones and tablets. Galaxy S24, S24 Plus, and Galaxy S24 Ultra. Galaxy S23, S23 Plus, and Galaxy S23 Ultra. Galaxy S23 Fan Edition. Galaxy S22, S22 Plus, and Galaxy S22 Ultra. Galaxy S21 Fan Edition. Galaxy S21 Series. Galaxy Z Fold 6, Z Fold 5, Z Fold 4, and Z Fold 3. Z Flip 6, Flip 5, Flip 4, and Z Flip 3. Galaxy A73 and A72. 
Galaxy A55, A54, and A53. Galaxy A35, A34, and A33. Galaxy A25, A24, and A23. Galaxy A15 and A14, LTE plus 5G. Galaxy Tab S9 Fan Edition Plus and Tab S9 Fan Edition. Galaxy Tab S9, Tab S9 Plus, and Tab S9 Ultra. Galaxy Tab S8, Tab S8 Plus, and Tab S8 Ultra. Galaxy F55 and F54. Galaxy F34, Galaxy F15. Galaxy M55, M54, M53, M34, and 33 and M15. We compiled the list based on several factors. Devices launched with Android 13 will likely receive Android 15, as Samsung typically offers two major OS upgrades. Flagships and mid-range phones eligible for four years of updates will also get Android 15, given Samsung's policy. Additionally, devices launching in 2024 are expected to come with Android 15. However, the list is not final and won't be until at least August or September. We'll update it as more information becomes available. I hope you liked the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.